welcome back to another episode of City Skyline. So it looks like there's a little bit of a chat traffic congestion over on this side. We might want to try fixing that. Um, <clears throat> let's see what's going on here. Everyone seems to be slowing down because they're trying to turn on to the off-ramp. Uh, that might be part of the issue. Uh, we could probably fix that by... Um, Designing a better off-ramp. I'll take a little bit of time to do that, but it should be possible to do. Uh, if we move everything more over to here, we have a little bit more room. I think that might help. Let's try that and see how it goes. Might be able to... Um, hmm, yes. Um... Yeah, it, it's going to be a difficult spot to really work with, I think. Because traffic's backing up pretty far back here, too, right? So we'll have to figure out a way to get them around. But still offering that second lane. Because that lane's been really helping with the traffic congestion. So, um... But we don't... We obviously don't have enough to wrap around I don't think so like not enough room to do that unless we break up this road which we could do we could do that I'm not sure what's over here it is some businesses by the looks of it so we can definitely move this one um, further down I think and connect it up directly to there and that should help so let's go to this tab, we'll grab the off-ramp. We'll see if we can't connect it up. Uh, we'll have to move that, I think. A little bit further out. Given that they're all coming from this angle anyways. Oh, we got the subway system here too, don't we? Okay, guess we're not doing that. Um... Could branch out just a little bit further down, I guess. And we'll need to go up. Or what we could do is we could just have the connection more over on this side. That might work too. We'll see if we can't go over that highway.
I got a national park in. I was thinking about this when I was editing yesterday, was to put a park in this uh, little strip of the mountains that we were basically just using for decoration. So, um, we already had quite a bit of it unlocked. We had a few different levels. I think we have a, another national park. Oh, looks like we're power lines are down. That's not good. That could be why we're going into my debt. We'll fix that up. Just have to um, move some of that. There we go. That should help. Okay. So, yes, uh, as I was saying, I think we had a national park over here, maybe? Yeah, this is the national park. And it looks like it's recently burnt down, so. <laughs> you can always tell when the trees are, like, charred and no leaves on them. But, um, when it's actually full and green, it looks a lot better, from what I remember. We put some tents in, some other things, gazebos and fire pits and stuff like that, so. This is the level 3, so we had level 3 stuff unlocked already. So, I put some stuff in through here, but I want to get some lights in now. Um, at the moment it's a little bit dark, so I wanted to see if I can't get some some general lights in just along the path just so people can see where they're going might want to put some other things in here as well some other props okay, I probably want a light there I'll do another light around here We'll see if we can't light up this uh, path a little bit nicer. Uh, I'm using props because I don't really like the wires along the um, the actual ones with lights, the cables. So I wanted to try something a little bit different just to kind of get this all looking nice. And I figured placing the lights by hand would probably be better. So I know it costs us money, but it is what it is can always rotate them as well so we can get that right angle that we want so this goes to an exit and I think it continues down that way so yeah it already looks a lot better with the lights I think we can control the light level too like how far apart they are
of the uh, things that I've been working on are basically decorating the pathway uh, for the national park. And I've been adding whole kinds of props and stuff to the um, pathways and stuff like that. Let's see if we can't get into this mode and kind of give a preview of what it looks like. So I added ferns, some grass, some small trees uh, that are kind of give some extra variety in the area as well. Uh, there's also rocks, different types of those bushes. Uh, there's the ferns and then there's kind of like shrubbery around in some parts. And I've tried to make a little bit of areas where there is um, places where people can get water for camping and uh, picnic benches as well as some firewood in an outhouse so they can get that. And I've been doing that along this whole entire path. I got to this point and then I needed to clean up some of the trees and stuff so I could actually put some stuff in there but basically that's the method that I'm going with is kind of like that as you can see it looks really good the way that it's set up and I think I'll just continue doing that all the way through and we might make some small parts like this uh, a little bit more grassy and stuff like that to simulate some different biomes maybe and I need to move this a little bit more over I think moving it to the other side might be a little bit more beneficial and these are all on kind of like a cliff, so it's really hard to do stuff with them. But um, over here, I've been just kind of experimenting with the path and stuff. Now, with the path, um, I, I'll need to adjust it because it kind of gets thrown over by the foliage over here. So I, I want to fix that and kind of bring it over this way, I guess. We'll see if we can't do that instead. So... Um, Let's get our bulldozer tool, just pause the game. And then that way it leaves a little bit more forested area over there too. So I don't want to really destroy this whole thing, but we'll have to. And we'll have to go to here and grab our paths as well. I'll have to adjust those lights in this area as well. Now that I think of it. So we'll bring that up, and then we'll bring it over like that. And might need to connect up the path a little bit differently. So we'll bring it around like that. Hopefully that will work. And we'll have to adjust the lights, but I think that will work pr pretty good. A little bit of a steep hill there. <laughs> we might need to fix that to kind of bring it in a little bit more. Um, flatten it out maybe.
got a quite a bit of of a section done for this uh, natural or nation national park <laughs> natural park. Um, yeah, so we got like this part done, which we started with, and there's a few different uh, buildings that people can go to. There's the uh, lookout towers. Um, I put some little decorations in just to kind of decorate it a little bit more and then there's rocks, ferns, bushes, trees, small trees, different sizes of trees, uh, lots of rocks. Um, and then there's campsites like this. So I want to put at least a couple more campsites like this in. Uh, we'll see if we can't put them a couple more over on this side. Uh, left a little bit of area open so we can try that. And there's a little bit of a spot a little further up here that we can try to put it into. So we'll see if we can't do that uh, next episode. And then we got all this uh, to decorate still, which goes right to here. So outside of that, we got um, quite a bit of stuff done. I think we fixed uh, the traffic issue over here as well. Uh, where is it? Over here. So it's actually flowing a little bit. Well was flowing a little bit better. I'm not sure what's causing them to kind of stop like that. I might need to check the um, junctions. No, they're, they're just not going that way. I don't know. We'll put like stop signs on those sides. Maybe that will help. Uh, could be people crossing over. Maybe. Not sure why they would be crossing over. Oh, you know what it is? It's a subway. People are crossing over because of the subway. That's what the issue is. Okay. Uh, that makes a lot more sense. Uh, what we could do next episode is bring this over and connect it directly up to the part here. And hopefully that will help a little bit more. Um... That way they don't need to go directly through here, and then we can just make that an underpass uh, over, and then we'll connect it up with a sidewalk somewhere further down. I think that might help. Uh, actually, there's sidewalks all around, so they don't really need that. Outside of that, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.